You're going up the escalator? I'm going to be dating her in 10 years. Can you believe it? You can hear him say, I'm going to be dating her in 10 years. Can you believe it? Um, Major, I wonder how concerned the Trump campaign is about videos like that one continuing to surface. Deeply concerned. The Trump campaign is, I think it's fair to say, on eggshells about any disclosures, any videotape, audio tape, any accusations coming from other women about untoward remarks, physical aggression, anything in this category of Trump acting like someone unfit for the presidency or unfit as a gentleman. And the Trump campaign doesn't know what's out there, doesn't know what may or may not be coming. And Trump has not really given those closest to him any indication about what might be out there. One of this thing, one of this realities of the Trump campaign, Elaine, and it's been never more apparent than it is now. Unlike most people who run for the presidency, it appears Donald Trump did very little opposition research on himself. Most people who seek the presidency, skilled politicians, do all of that in advance or as much of it as they can to find out all the potentially negative things that might be out there, how to prepare for them, how to respond, and how to keep them out of public view, if at all possible. The last couple of weeks certainly indicate that if Donald Trump was curious about that, he wasn't curious enough. And the fact that his closest advisors now live in a state of semi-panic about what may or may not be coming indicates to me that Trump didn't do very much of this across the entire realm of possibility, which leaves his campaign and those closest to it and Trump himself vulnerable to whatever may come next. Yeah, that's a really good point, Major. Uh, as you well know, opposition research really is one of the mainstays of tradition.